If you're always working with PDFs, I have a great tool that I want to recommend to you. It's called a first soft and it's a PDF editor that has AI power built into it. Now, what you can do is obviously you can view it, you can edit it, you can modify it, highlight it. You can summarize with AI, talk to it with AI and do a whole lot more with it. So let me show you what I'm talking about right now. Hey, what's up everyone? This is a first soft PDF editor and I already have it installed here on my Mac desktop. Now, this is available on all platforms and with one single license, you get access to all these platforms. So you can use it on Windows, Mac, desktop, and you won't have any issues with one single license. Okay, so first of all, you can chat with PDF, you can edit PDFs, OCR, you can do a whole lot of things with it. But what I'm going to do is load in the PDF right now to show you what you can do with it. So in this case, let me go ahead and open up this text form that I'm always using. And let's go ahead and zoom in. Okay, here we go. And obviously we're able to view the PDF, but we can do a whole lot more than just viewing it. Okay. So in this case, the first thing is we have selected the select tool. So that means that if I highlight any of this text, I can go ahead and copy it. I can highlight it with another color. I can underline it. I can <clears throat> slash it and I can do a whole lot of things with it. Now in this case, I'm in the home section, so I get access to the basic tools. But if I go into a specific section like edit, I have all the editing features right here. So I can add text, crop, I can select, I can use the hand to move it around. And let me show you, for example, if I select this text, I can go ahead and edit it right now by just typing in, deleting, removing, etc. Or I can go ahead and highlight this, change the font to something else like this, just some random font. I can change sizing, color of the text, the alignment, the object, and it's just super easy to edit text with this tool. So I can also add text. So if I need to add some random text somewhere, I just go ahead and do so by selecting the area and typing in. Or if I need to crop the page for some certain reason and I have the option to crop it, all right? Next, I have the comment section where I can go ahead and highlight sections with a dedicated tool right here. Selecting colors, I can underline, I can strike through, I can tilt or add a sticker to here, which is always super easy to do with a first soft PDF. Now I can also convert this into another format. So if I don't need it in PDF format, I can convert it to Word, Excel, PowerPoint, to image, to PDF, more options right here, to other formats right there. Batch convert, I can also view right here. So view full screen, single page scrolling, zoom in, zoom out, etc. I can also change pages. So if I need to move the pages, let me go ahead, go ahead and open up another PDF right here for the testing purposes. Here we go. Let's go into page and we have the selection here. So I can move these around in case I want to realign them. I have the option to select the page here from a range. I can anti-clockwise. So if I want to change it clockwise, delete it, extract it, or crop the page, I can do so with these tools. Now, there's also the AI feature. Let me go ahead and show you with this one. Let's go ahead and view it. Okay, here we go. Let's use the AI feature so it reads what this is about. Okay, so let's go ahead and start it up. Let's go ahead and save. Okay, and it's uploading first the PDF, so it summarizes it for us. Okay, so let's give it a few seconds. Oh, here we go. It's done. Okay, and now it's telling us what this PDF is for. And we can actually chat with the AI right here, which makes it a super useful tool. Okay, now what about OCR? Okay, let me go ahead and upload right now so we can use an OCR. Let me go ahead and select this right here that has some images with text. Okay, here we go. So these are not editable. It's not an editable PDF. I can't select this, but if we use OCR, go to perform it, I can scan to editable text. I can scan for searchable text in the image. So it reads it, but it doesn't turn it into text. But in this case, we want to turn it into editable text. So let's go ahead and perform OCR. And it should take a few seconds. And here we go. It's done. So if now we can select these sections and we can go ahead and select it, we are able to edit these sections now. And it's just that easy to use OCR with a first soft PDF editor. Okay. So basically, if you want to check it out, I will be leaving a link in the description where there's an extra discount. And I do recommend that you start off with the free account and then upgrade with that extra discount. So that's all for today. And that's a wrap.